Hi, I'm Malami from EO Botanica. Welcome back. You guys are fantastic. I love these comments you guys have been giving. Remember, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell for notifications, and in the description box below, send us your email address by clicking on that link. Today, we're going to talk about something that is quick and easy and gives you fantastic results. We're going to do a work with coffee. So let's get started. Today, you know, everyone knows about coffee. Everyone has either smelled coffee, drank coffee. Some people are addicted to coffee. Some, it's some cultures, it is a tradition to have a lot of coffee, whether it be espresso, however. So that already says something about this thing, right? So coffee is like an accelerant, wouldn't you say? Like people drink coffee because they want to boost in the morning, right? You want to boost yourself. Well, this is why we're going to do a work with coffee because coffee is a booster. We're going to use it in this work today, quick and simple to get something done right? So if you're waiting for a phone call from someone, if you are doing love work, if you are doing money work, you could even use this for all different kinds of luck work. I wouldn't necessarily use it for, um, negative work unless you're really, really seasoned. There are ways that you can use this for, um, any kind of negative or domination work. It isn't, it, it isn't bad to use it in terms of it's pretty good to use it um, for convincing work, right? You need someone to be convinced in a good way to give you favor or in some situation like that. So overall, this work today is to amplify, charge it up and get results. So let's get started in looking at how I use coffee sometimes to get things done. Um, I just want to share with you some of the things that I have here today. Um, we have a tobacco cologne, optional. Coffee soap, which we have handmade coffee soap. Fantastic. Great for the ancestors, great for your spirit guides. And this work can be done on the floor in front of an ancestral altar. It can be done at a prosperity luck altar, something like that or you can just do it in your house with no altar whatsoever because it works no matter what. So we have here, like I told you, the soap and we have seven white candles, seven white candles. So these seven white candles are a substitute for this. My, one of my favorite, 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 favorite candles a knob candle. This is in some of our videos already, um, but I'm going to talk a little bit about it today. And this is a substitute for those of you guys who can't get this or are ready to do your work ASAP. Fantastic. All right. Got some oil, mortar and pestle. This is a great coffee scrub oh, that we have. And it's great to use with the coffee soap because again, if you're doing this work, and especially if you're doing this work with your guides, you want to be able to not only do it with your guides, but to bring them in, right? So again, this is about action. So we got to get it happening. So it's good to do this to yourself. You can use um, the scrub with yourself, the soap, or not. But I will say that this is a part of the work if you choose. And we have coffee grinds. So for those of you, some people have been looking for a new employment. We have job powder. This is optional, 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 optional. And this is quick, quick powder. Again, it's optional, but some of you guys like a whole bunch of ingredients in your work. So I'm giving you some ideas, but I'm not sure exactly which one of these yet. It's going to be a little surprise which one I use. And we have frankincense. If you don't have the powders, make sure you have frankincense and coffee grinds, your good luck oil. Those are the three main things that you need to have for this video. 
frankincense, coffee, some kind of good luck or speed it up oil and your white candles. So now I want to do this work to open things up because I want some quick results on some things that I have been asking about over the last week and um, it's gonna work. So I'm gonna take my candle, I'm gonna use this one for now and I'm gonna show you guys how to incorporate the other ones. So the first thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put my frankincense in here. For the sake of conversations, maybe good for you guys to see and to hear how this comes together, right? You can use a big or a small mortar and pestle. Doesn't really matter. The key is we want to make sure that the frankincense is just a little bit small that we can add some stuff to it. So, and it's a gift of prosperity. What are we asking for? A breakthrough. So I'm going to put my coffee here. And remember that evening, you can use either some of the coffee scrub, which is fine. I'm going to add a little bit here because it helps you to connect you to the work. You guys know I'm famous for that. If anybody watches any of my videos, you guys know I'm all about connecting yourself to the work, right? That's one of my claim to fame, so to speak. So now I have some oil. I'm going to show you with this candle and this candle very quickly. All right, so we put our oil on. And again, you're making your prayer and your request for what your issue is, right? What you're trying to make a breakthrough about. These little candles. I'm going to do all seven of them, but for the video, I'm only going to light a few. But I'm going to show you how you'd have it set up in your own home and you'd be burning one of these per day, right? You're not gonna burn all seven of them together. You're gonna burn one per day. So now this is you. You're going to be, whoops, gonna sprinkle some of my frankincense in here. Gonna mix that together. And I'm gonna roll it. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. I'm gonna roll that in there. This is one of my favorite candles because this candle, naturally, a knob candle is a forcing candle. So now we put our coffee. We've mixed a little bit of our scrub. We have some frankincense. If you don't remember anything else, frankincense, oil, and coffee. <laughs> So now we have all of this. If you want to write, you wanted to write on your candles before you started, you wanted to write your name, anything like that, you're more than welcome to do that. For the sake of the video, I like to just pray over it, say what I want as I prepare it, and get to it, right? So now we've got our candles. We have um, our coffee here. And now I'm going to build this part. So now, for those of you, I just want to say, if it is that you're trying to get a new job, you need to use job, you can use job oil. You can, I mean, job powder. You can sprinkle some inside, sprinkle some on your candles. If you're just trying to speed things up and you want to add an amplifier, you're more than welcome to use um, quick, quick powder or pull, pull powder. Again, you can sprinkle those on there. I'm not going to do that for now because some of you guys don't have this available. And I want you to see this can be nice and simple without being overly extravagant. Remember, oil, coffee, frankincense, and white candles. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. It's unbelievable. Smells like being brewed. And of course, you can use some of the scrub to connect you to the work. Ancestor guides, spirit guides, no matter where you come from, Europe, Africa, India, wherever you come from, all guides love coffee, as in ethnicities. 
does not the person per se, but ethnicity. So now, if you have this, you put it in the middle. You only light one. Today, you turn it off. The next day, turn it off. The next day, turn it off. It's one bump per day. But for those of you guys who may not have that available, just gonna put a little bit. This is not necessary, but I like to put a little bit of glitter. So this is a multicolored glitter, one of my favorites, because cover, covering our bases. I'm gonna use any, and here's another one, which is a color like copper. It's like a goldy copper color. This is all optional, but it looks fantastic and it works very, very well. Why? Because now we're bringing an illumination to this work. Do you see how it's just illuminating and glistening and beautiful? I love it. The tobacco water, you can sprinkle a little bit inside if you like, and you can also add it to your spiritual bath. These are the only reasons why I have them here. So let's say today is day one. This is you, then day two as an example, right? If you do not have this candle, how beautiful is that, right? So for you, remember it's one per day. So for the sake of the video, I'm gonna light that and light this. So if you have the knob candle, it's just the knob, hair to hair, day one, day one, day two, day two, day two, day three, day three, day four, day four. Do you understand? If you don't have this, it's one candle per day. If you only have this, then it's one bump per day. I bet you guys are surprised to see how I just did that. So quick and easy. Frankincense, coffee, oil, and a white candle. And a little bit of glitter if you wanna put that to bring more illumination to your work. So if you like that, give me a thumbs up. Hit the bell for notification in our description box below. Click that link and become a part of our exclusive YouTube channel list. So I hope you guys try this out. And if you wanna see a coffee bath, tell me in the comments below. See you next time. Ashe, ashe, ashe. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this video, like us, share us with others, give me a thumbs up, hit the bell for notifications, and come visit us in the store. Check us out on all social media. See you next time.